Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of the YouTube world, CJ Rose is back in the building. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to NBA 2K Rivals Magic and Bird Era 1988. Year number five. I've had a couple people see the finals, a couple people win awards, a couple people on some all NBA teams, all star appearances. Now it's time to see if somebody. Is moving or if they're just resigning we'll see player retirements uh, Bill Walton calls it a career after 11 years Paul Westfall calls it a career. he's actually not been in the league for a minute Bobby Jones calls it a career yeah got some Jersey retirements from Paul Westpaul. Respect. I historic changes. Let's see. And we got some expansion teams. We got some expansion teams. Miami Heat and Charlotte Hornets. Welcome to the NBA. And now the, the number of officials have been changed to three. And now the Golden State Warriors changed their logo, uniforms, and floor. All right. Oh, I thought we had an expansion draft. That would be cool. All right, league meetings. Yes, yes. Okay. Okay. During this period, you can make changes to the league's alignment and put teams where they are. Nope, I liked the way everything is well, actually. <laughs> Somebody went over here, right? Or is this all the teams? This all the teams. Yeah. This is better. I mean, if you want to do that, I don't really care. All right, draft lottery. Can the Bullets finally get the number one overall pick? And they don't. <laughs> they never do. Instead, Portland Trailblazers get the number one overall pick. The Spurs get second. Bullets get third. Hornets, Heat, and Pacers get their picks. Okay. Ah, expansion. Yes. Okay. So we hear expansion. All right. So before we even get anywhere, let's go to. Exp let's see the expansion. Let's see the. Okay. I'm just. I'm just talking. The expansion draft is coming. If you are a new expansion team, check out all the other. On who the other teams are protected from the draft. If you are a league team, you can protect up to eight players. Choose wisely. So Muggsy Bogues will be in it. John Sally. Isaiah Thomas. Akeem. Kareem. Michael Jordan. Moses Malone. Mark Aguirre. I know us will be in it. So are we going to be part of the expansion draft? I'm actually intrigued. Let's see. The expansion draft. There we go. Clark Kellogg got picked number one. Joe Wilkins, number two. Robin's going to the Hornets. I'll throw some big time players. That's not even that crazy. All right, to the NBA draft. 1988 NBA draft. Let's see. The Portland Trailblazers with the first overall pick. They pick up Danny Manning. All right. Uh, Spurs number two. Spurs pick up Mitch Richmond. That's a very good pickup. That is a really good pickup. Bullets number three. They pick up. Well, yeah, right. That's end of the draft. <laughs> Get Hershey Hawkins. Okay. Rod Strickland goes to the Heat. Rex Chapman goes to the Pacers. Uh, Rick Smith goes to the Kings. Uh, Dan Marley goes to the Hawks. All the people I really I don't really care about. All right, free agency. It's a big night. 
We are all free agents. Isaiah Thomas, Akeem Olajuwon, Kareem, Michael Jordan, Moses Malone, Mark Aguirre, Rose, Stockton. Like this is this right here. This right here is an impact. This right here is probably the best, the best free agency. I'm still a free agent, by the way. I got 10 offers. Got 10 offers. I'm a restricted free agent. That's why. Why am I a restricted free agent? I'm coming back to the same Marna. <laughs> of course I would. <laughs> of course I would. Because why not? Because <laughs> why not? God. I got the uh the fourth overall pick with me and then I got the third overall pick with me. <laughs> Lord. Dave Robinson's not A seven overall. <laughs> yeah. Robert Parrish continues to get worse as well as Dennis Johnson. Shaolin goes left, and in his place comes Rai Ruga. Rai Ruga goes to the Clippers to join the Dinner Nana. Interesting. Sabonis is still here. I see Shadow is gone. Hadrian Daly is getting worse. I guess you were a restricted free agent too, so I guess he picked up his. The Knicks, the champs, looking to rebuild. The Lake Show. Ron Harper's not A4 overall. Oh, M Max Money went to the Nets. He went to the Nets. Look at that. Oh, Dallas De Shrimp went to the Pacers. And they got Horace Grant and Rex Chapman. They're looking to rebuild. Isaiah Thomas is gone. So is Blocks. Blocks left. In fact, I'm about to just walk into something crazy. Cedric Maxwell. Getting older. Michael Jordan's progressing. Well, Shadow went to the Spurs. Mark Price got better. Way better than Kevin Johnson. Dominique Wilkins went to the Sun. And Ghost went to the Ghost went to the Suns. Actually, Dominique Wilkins has been on the Suns, but Ghost went to the Suns and he tore his right ACL. He won't even play this season. I don't even know if he'll play this season. We'll see. Sonics, the Trailblazers, Warriors. Blocks went to the Miami Heat. That's his team now, so we'll see how that goes. Isaiah Thomas and Alex English and Clark Kellogg went to the expansion team of the Charlotte Hornets. Moses Irvin and Cheeks are still here. Moses Malone going down a little bit, progressing. Sidney Moncrief, Brad Doughty. I feel like I'm forgetting somebody. No, I don't think I am. All right, let's, let's, let's move on. It's a 1989 draft. Who the hell is in this draft class? Who's in this draft class? 
Purvis Ellison, I don't know who that is. I do know who Glenn Rice is, and I know who Tim Hardaway is. I know Danny Ferry. I know Sean Kemp. I know Big Dog Cliff Robinson. I know Vladdy D. Boss Dino, Sean Elliott, Nick Anderson, BJ Armstrong. Uh, I don't think anybody else is hitting the, the brain. Yeah, nobody else is in the brain. I ain't gonna lie to you. I want the season end, bro. So we just going we just, we just going. I'm sorry, we just going. And already we are just horrible, bro. God, we are just, we sorry, bro. We're just sorry. We're just a sorry team, man. All right, now let's see who was actually who. Who's an all-star this year? Isaiah Thomas, the man who was a two-time Sixth Man of the Year, made it to the All-Star game. Larry Bird, Moses, Larry Bird, Moses Malone, and Kim Olajuwon, John Stockton, Sidney Moncrief, Carl Malone, Julius Servin, Jeff Ruin, Jay Blocks, and me. All right, so I made it to the All-Star game again, dropping twenty-seven, four and. 6, 49, 31, 70. I'm just going ballistically crazy. Blocks 20 and 9 with 4 assists. Almost 2 blocks on 52% shooting. Coming out to West is Magic and Mike. As always, Kareem, Dominique, and Mark Aguirre. Rose is here. 21, 7, and 5. 59, 48, 71. George Gervin, Dan Lee, Pat Ewing, Kiki, Mullen, and Clyde Drexler. Okay. Interesting. All right. We already know how this season looking. Wow, the Miami Heat come in their first season as an expansion team. And they are the best team in the league. Is it because uh, Mr. J Block's here? I mean, they have a pretty good damn solid lineup. Oh, no, Chicago's coming at number two. There are Twin Towers over here, 25 and 12 for Akeem, 21 and 10 for David Robinson. The Knicks, the defending NBA champions, coming at number three. Daryl Dawkins is here. Malone, 23 and 10. Doc Rivers, 10 and 10. Bernard King is hurt. He's only dropping 20. And Dale Curry dropping 17. So when they get healthy, them Knicks are going to be a problem. Milwaukee comes at number four. I think Brad Doughty's making a real big impact on this team, so that's good to see. Charlotte Hornets, well, they actually got a good they, – they were able to actually get some good pieces. They got Isaiah Thomas, and they got Alex English. So they, they pretty did well in the expansion draft. Philly come in at number six. It was Malone, 26 and 11. Not bad. Julius Irvin, 22 points. And Maurice Cheeks. Where's Maurice Cheeks? Number seven of the Nets. Max Money. 12 and 8. Okay. Interesting. And the Boston Celtics rounded out at number eight. Larry is regressing. You can tell by the numbers. Cleveland, Detroit, Atlanta. And the worst team in the league. Well, damn, Pacers are that bad, too. Damn, Stockton. Welcome to the party. Coming on the west side, the Lakers are still second. That's crazy. But Dallas is actually making a hell of a run for themselves. Dallas is just shooting that pill at 66%. Looking amazing. L.A. is just L.A. Magic 23 and 8. Reem 26 and 13. Reem is stepping this game up. Utah at number 3. Seattle at number 4. Clippers at number 5. 17 and 10 for the Dawn. While Ride's points went tremendously down at 16 points. I guess. Well, they got Reggie Diaz too, but I guess. Six man, possibly. The Golden State Warriors getting a lot better. Scotty Pippen. Better numbers than previous. 
Charles Oakley doesn't really score the ball, but he's definitely rebounding that ball. I can tell you that now. Portland coming at number seven. The Glide is now gliding. 23 points a game. The Sacramento Kings rounding out the eight spot. With Cash and Mullen running the helm. Denver comes in at number nine. Gervin is really putting in work. Where he's putting in work. Houston is here. MJ by himself. And surprisingly by himself. He scores a little less. Phoenix and San Antonio was the worst team in the West. Shadows numbers are getting much better. They're going up. But eh, not much to it. It is what it is, man. I see a war races. So Kareem could be a back-to-back -back MVP. I don't think it matters if it's if it's Magic or Kareem. That MVP trophy is staying right in L.A. Danny Manning looks to be Rookie of the Year. Six Man of the Year could be Jack Sigma, and I was right. Ryan is in the race for Six Man of the Year. See how that goes. Defense play of the year could go to Akeem again. I think that'll be what number four. It would be number four if he wins it again. And most people could go to mug actually four people off the <laughs> four people off the heat it can go to. All right, let's uh let's finish the rest of the season up. Man, I haven't seen playoffs in, like, what, three to four seasons? It's been that bad, man. It's been that bad. But my stupid self wants to re-sign here like it's all good. Well, Akeem could add a... He adds a MVP to his resume along with his Defensive Player of the Year. So, that's interesting. Uh, rookie of the Year goes to Mitch Richmond. Jack Sigmo, Sixth Man of the Year. And Akeem wins four Defensive Player of the Year. So that's four Defensive Player of the Year and an MVP. Muggsy Bogues, Most Improved. And Jamal Anderson, who's the coach of the Heat. The Heat won 70 games. How does an expansion team... <laughs> That just made their uh, first appearance in the league automatically are one of the greatest teams of all time. <laughs> That's, yo, that is, that is wild. <laughs> and look at this. Even though I'm on a bad team, I am, I am all on the all NBA first team. 26, 4, and 6, 50, 31, 78. Jay Humphreys actually makes NBA all NBA first team, and I see why. <laughs> I see why. Twenty nine and eight. I see why. Carmelo, Larry Bird, and Akeem continue their streak. You got Michael Jordan, Scottie Pippen makes all NBA second team. Dominique makes it. The Dawn makes all NBA second team. Is this? He's been in the second all second team all NBA for the last three seasons. This is his third in a row. Amazing. NBA third team: Magic, Stockton, Aguirre, Dantley, and Patrick Ewing. All defensive first team: Horace Grant makes it. Scottie Pippen, Matt, Mike, uh, Clyde, and Keem. Sidney Moncrief, Chris Morris makes it for the first makes a, a defensive team for the first time. Carl Malone, James Worthy, and Patrick Ewing. These are the rookie teams, and here we are. So let's look at how everybody did. Well, let's just look at... Stand I'm sorry, it's power rankings. Look at standings. Again, the Heat became the greatest team in the history of the game. I don't know how they did it off their first season. But Mr. Blocks with 21, 10, and 4, almost two blocks. Jay is winning now. He was winning before, but nah, not like this. <laughs> not like this. Chicago is second. 
Philly coming third, Milwaukee's fourth. The defending champions are fifth. Number six is Charlotte. Number seven is Nets, and Boston rounds it out. Uh, the worst team in the league and in the East is me. Dallas comes in number one. Lakers still there. Jazz number three. Seattle number four. The reigning Western Conference champions are number five. Uh, Portland is number six. Sacramento is seventh, and Golden State is eight. Worst team in the West is the Phoenix Suns. All right, so let's do this playoff time, baby. And the Lakers just don't have it in them anymore. They don't. They get swept again in the first round for the second year in a row. And the the eighth seed actually beat the one seed. So Rose got eliminated in the first round. That's that's sad. That's terrible. And his numbers were down a little bit. Seattle sweeps. I think Seattle gets their revenge from last season. Rod picked up his game, but just too late. Portland beats Utah. And the Lakers get swept by the Kings. The Kings are in the playoffs. And Cash is losing his mind. He's picked it up in the playoffs. You'd love to see it. How tall is he? How, I'm sorry, how tall, how tall are you? How are you 6'10 and you don't average no blocks? <laughs> like, what, what are we doing? What are we doing? The Heat beat the Celtics in five. The defending champions lose in the first round to the Bucks. Charlotte beats Philly, and the Nets lose to the Twin Towers. 29 and 10, 20, and 16. Money, what was we, what were we doing, bro? You got killed, bro. <laughs> well, I mean, you once again, Max Money once again faced the DPOI, and he got destroyed again. All right, conference semis. Let's get it. And Seattle advances. And the Kings were so close to get to the conference finals, but they lose to Portland. And the Heat swept the the Heat swept the Bucks. And the Bulls able to beat the, the Hornets in seven. We got a four and six matchup from the West. So that's interesting. Meanwhile, the best team in the East, the best team in the league, face off against the MVP and the DPOI. This should be interesting. All right, game one. Game two. Game three. Game four. The Miami Heat beat. The MVP and the DPOY, and they're headed to the finals. So, Mr. Blocks is in the finals for his first time as he is leading an expansion team that just became the greatest team of all time, literally overnight. <laughs> and they take on Patrick Ewing. So, look at this. Look at this. Blocks versus Ewing. You want to talk about set two seven footers going at it? You about to see it. This should be exceptionally interesting. I am ready for all this. All right, game one. All right. Game two. All right. Game three. Okay. Game four. Game five. And I think there is no way this has ever happened. Actually, this never happened in history. But for the first time in Lee in a probably sports history, we had an expansion team brand new on the scene become the great one of the greatest teams of all time, go straight to the finals, and win the NBA title. The Miami Heat NBA champions, which means out of everybody in the league, every out of everybody. Jay Blocks is the first person to win a ring, and he wins finals MVP. 
So far, Jay Blocks is having the best season out of all of us. So far, because he's the only one to win a ring. You love to see it. Love to see it. 1989. Let's get it. 